James, of course, I've watched you grow up here in Bethel. And, but I first really saw the hand of God on you Mother's Day before last when Debbie was speaking. Remember when, he, remember when James introduced you, Debbie? And when you got up, I saw the hand of God come down on you. In fact, I told your mom and dad after that service. And I would not put my hands on you unless I saw God's hand on you. I'm, I'm one of the board members, elders. I can remember talking about this. And James is not here because of his earthly parents. He is here because of his heavenly father, though. And I'm going to lay my hands on him in a moment and install him as our youth minister. And um, I, I, the same thing was done to me when I was 20 out of the Army. I became the young adults pastor. God have mercy on all those young adults. I learned on them. But here I am almost 49 years later. Paul told Timothy James, let no man despise your youth. Instead, let your character be filled with Christ. Your teachability, your humility, your honesty, your integrity, your purity. James, God's putting his hand on you. You already can speak. Preaching will be the easiest thing for you. You'll inspire But God's now going to shape your heart and form you under the weight of this youth group. You'll weep over what he weeps over. You'll be joyful what he joys over. And he will form the very depths of your heart to pastor, to love, to care. The fact of it is you're 20 going on 40. You already have an old soul. You outgrew baby James many years ago. My hand's going to come on you. My words are going to rest on your tongue like a sparking fire. I'm going, not only will the spirit of the evangelist be on you, it'll fall on this whole youth group. You'll build on the great foundations that your sister has laid before you. And I will bless you and anoint you. I will bless this group. And a catalytic spirit of evangelism will sweep over the young people. Inviting their friends and seeing them saved will become normal. You're coming into a time of great revival in that generation. I'll bless them. It'll grow. And you'll never take credit for it because it'll be my glory that does it. Now, always honor myself. Always give me credit. Always give me what I'm due. And I'll never cease to bless you. Let's give God a great hand. Willing, able. Hallelujah. Thank you.